China's Dong Feng is taking a major stake in PSA Peugeot Citroën as part of a rescue deal for the struggling French car maker. Dong Feng, the second biggest Chinese vehicle manufacturer, is to inject 800 million euros into Peugeot, as will the French government. Badly hit by Europe's car sales slump, Peugeot's being kept afloat by 7 billion euros in state guarantees. Peugeot's board approved the deal on Tuesday. In return for their investment, Dong Feng and the French state each get 14% of the company. The Peugeot family's holding will fall to the same amount. In addition, new shares will be sold to existing investors, bringing the total fundraising effort to 3 billion euros. The deal has divided the Peugeot family, but Paris is talking it up as a perfect marriage. The industry minister said PSA, you know, PSA Peugeot Citroën has the technology but sells mostly in Europe without enough access to the fast-growing Asian market. Dong Feng lacks technology and an international brand presence but does have growth in Asia. So this is a good way of pooling their resources. This is the latest example of a big Chinese firm expanding through investment in a struggling Western brand as happened with Sweden's Volvo or just last month with Lenovo's plan to buy Motorola Mobility from Google. But analysts have cast doubt over the logic behind the deal. Some argue that it would have been better for Peugeot instead to sell its financing arm, which lends money to new car buyers, or even its parts division for Isia. This way, Peugeot does get some badly needed cash, but also gains a much more complicated ownership arrangement, which could mean it being pulled in three different directions.